Hello guys, it is Linacat here, and today I'm back with another video. Now then guys, um, today is not going to really be like a gaming video, although it will be related to Minecraft. Anyways guys, um, long story short, people have actually been asking me a lot lately, like, how to make HD Minecraft skins, because I've actually made my own, and, like, have been using them on, like, servers and worlds and stuff like that. But yeah, guys, so, technically that's what I'm going to show you guys today. So, I'm going to use this app called Medibang. You can also use it for other stuff, of course, like Photoshop and art and stuff like that. Because that's basically how I made my background. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and go into Medibang now. So, here we go. So, as you guys can see, I've already made quite a bit of HD Minecraft skins, but I'm just going to use, like, the original template that I use for them, which is right here. So we're going to let it load for a little bit. There we go. Now then, guys, you want to do don't extract line art because it'll make the skin black and white, and we do not want that. Unless, of course, you want, like, a gray skin, I guess. But, yeah. So... This is basically the template I'm using. Now then, um, obviously, it's just your basic 64 by 64 Minecraft skin. It's not anything like special or high resolution, but we will change that. So before I show you guys how to do that, um, there's something important I want to show you about the brush tool. Now then, as you guys can see, my brush tool is on Pixel 2, and you do select right here. And then there's all these, like, brushes you can use. Now then, um, obviously mine is Pixel 2, but there's, like, Airbrush, Watercolor, um, Stipple Pen, and all that. Now then, you want to use Pixel 2 because it'll make the colors, like, solid. Because if you use something like the pencil, then what will happen is that uh, you'll have a mess, technically. So let me show you real quick. So as you guys can see, I'm, like just marking random places and as you guys can see like the colors aren't you know solid colors they're all different shades of pink so I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of that because it's ugly <laughs> anyways guys um yeah so you want to do your brush you want to do is um pixel 2 now then the thing about it though is that if you want to like get all these brushes you will have to like make yourself an account but it is mostly free so you really shouldn't have any problems with that although like my account messed up but it still let me keep the pixel 2 brush so I'm not going to complain anyways um, I'm going to show you guys how to um, add more pixels to the skin so we're going to go down here um, those two like that tab right there and then we're going to do resolution so, you want your resolution to be 128 by 128. So, up, 128, there you go. So we have a 128 by 128 skin now. So as you guys can see, um, the eye is now divided up into more squares, which is good, because we want to add more detail. But, um, yeah, so just to let you guys know, um, do not try to set the resolution up higher than 128, because if you do that, then what's going to happen is that um, when you try to activate the skin in, like, Minecraft, it's going to say that it's not a real Minecraft skin, because trust me, guys, I've tried it. But, yeah, so <laughs> 120 is the max. So we're going to go ahead and, like, edit the eye, so, you know, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and set the colors up higher. There we go. Now then, guys, um, I'm not really going to bother too much with detail because there's really no point. Because this is a tutorial. So, guys, I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, set the colors. And then there you have it, just your basic skin again it's not beautiful but <laughs> it's fine guys now then guys um the other skins that i've created that i actually spent time on um i was able to like add like things to the back of the jackets like pictures and like little characters and stuff like that so if you guys would like to learn how to like do more stuff with this app then please let me know but yeah so 
basically I'm just gonna finish this off real quick because I hate it not being completed. Sorry guys, that's just me. So let's see. And there we have it. So the eyes are complete. Again, not perfect, but it's fine. So I'll just show you guys what I was talking about. So basically to the back of the shirt right here, which um, it is kind of hard to like navigate around the skin because like you're not really using a skin editor. You're really using some sort of like paint app. But there is some sort of diagram that you can like screenshot of to like learn all the um, parts. But yeah, so that's that's what you have right here. So now you're going to have to export it. Wait a second. There we go. So now you do export PNG slash JPG file. Now then, guys, you want to do PNG transparent because um, basically if you try to do it with, like, PNG or JPG, then then, then what's going to happen is that, like, either it's not going to activate the skin, like, it's going to say, uh, that's not a real Minecraft skin, or the skin's just going to be encased in this weird, like, white stuff, I guess. But, yeah, so we're going to do PNG transparent. I'm going to do save image. And there you have it, guys. So that's basically all for today. Now then, again, guys, um, this app is called Medibang. And you can download this on, like, an Android app. Sorry. Android device. Um, but I haven't really figured out how to, like, use it properly on there. But if you guys would like to learn how to use it on an Android device, then I guess I'll just have to figure out how to do it. But yeah, guys, this is basically all I'm going to show you guys today. So yeah. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. This is Winnie Cat. Song off till next time, and goodbye.